I think you've heard our chief say very clearly we have additional resources on the ground that we are working on a new strategic response that will uh, ensure that safety. Every situation is volatile and we will do as much as we can to ensure that safety. Um, we can't guarantee not knowing what incidents will happen, what groups will be gathered, but we have uh, every confidence that we are going to put the resources in place that are required and needed. And it is my sincere hope. I reach out to the community. I ask for continued conversation. All those leaders who have reached out to me personally, you are amazing in the message that you are carrying about nonviolence. And I have faith that we will continue to progress. We have seen social media that has uh, made those invitations. I don't have any way to evaluate uh, how much that was a part of what went on. We're going to continue to get information on that. Final question, Eric. Um, they should be expecting us to have these conversations right now. Uh, we're aware of those businesses. They should also see that increased presence. Um, as soon as we start seeing people um, misbehave, they will see an increased level of that presence, and they'll see us more, much more proactive to, um, to start locking criminal behavior up so that we don't experience the, um, the damages that we had last night. I think I answered that question as clearly as I can right now. Thank you all very much. Thank you all very much. Thank you all very much for coming. If you all have, if you all have We're investigating all of that, sir. All of that.